this video, we're going to go through how to do a one-handed knot. So as always, you'll need something to tie to and something to tie with. I'll be using this two-tone rope. And again, we're going to assume that the needle's on our purple end of this rope. Throw it across your incision and you get ready to tie. <clears throat> again, before we start tying, we want to cross the sutures, strands across the incision. So whatever's on the right side of the incision is going to go up and to the left. Whatever's on the left side of the incision is going to come down and to the right. And again, we're going to assume that we popped off our needle. <clears throat> All right, so you pick these up. And you pick them up and you hold them in your neutral position. I like to call this your neutral position. Neutral position is as though you're holding the reins of a horse. When we're tying suture, pretend like we're in the Wild West. Again, the OR is a rough and treacherous place. If you get these techniques down, it becomes much more manageable. <clears throat> so with the uh, one-handed tie, most of the work is going to be done with your right hand. And the, your left hand really just holds the suture for you. So with a one-handed knot, you're going to have, again, two throws. One of them, you're going to form you're going to pinch your suture between your index finger and your thumb and form an OK sign. Okay? Let the suture drop down, form an OK sign. Okay? That's your that's one of your throws. And then it's going to be utilizing your three digits and your middle finger is going to be doing most of the work. We'll come to the back to that in a second. Your second throw is utilizes a C and your index finger is the one that's going to be doing uh, most of the work. Alright, so now we get on our horse and we get ready to tie. Alright, as you're on your horse, you're riding, give an OK sign that you're ready to start tying. Get your OK sign and come down, you cut your suture in preparation and start tying. Cross the strands over your uh, three fingers and then what you're going to do is flex your middle finger catch the purple strand on the back side of your middle finger and hold it like this next we're going to kind of pinch down between your middle finger and your ring finger next thing you're going to do is you're going to let go with your uh, index finger and your thumb. You let this go. And then you're going to rotate your hand out under the bridge. And you're going to pull the suture out. This is going to give you your first throw, your half hitch. You throw that down. Come back to your neutral position. You're back on your horse, you're back in your neutral position, and you're back riding. And then, next thing you're going to do is Form a C, hold the suture facing towards you with your three fingers, form a C, and then what you're going to do is you're going to go underneath the bridge, kind of pull the suture away from you. Next thing you're going to do is with your thumb, pinch the suture, and you're going to pinch it between your middle finger and your thumb. Cross the suture on your index finger. So if you notice what this does for you is creates a gap in this region for you to do most of the work of tying. So the next thing you're going to do is flex your index finger and then you're going to catch the suture on the back side of your finger and then rotate your hand out. As you rotate your hand out, let go with your index finger and your thumb sorry, not your index finger, your middle finger and your thumb, let go of that. And you're going to rest this on the back side of your index finger, and you're going to pull this out. And again, if you notice, as if I pull this in this direction, it's going to twist my knot. So I want to turn my hands to get nice square knots. Then you come back to your neutral position. Back to your neutral position, give the OK sign, I'm ready to go again cut your suture, 
cross the strands over your three fingers, flex your middle finger, catch the purple strand on the back side of your, next, uh, your middle finger, throw it out, pinch this between your middle finger and ring finger, let go with your index finger and your thumb, bring your hand across the bridge, pull this suture through, and then you throw it down. Back to your neutral position. You're back on your horse, you're riding again. Make your C. Go down, go underneath the suture, underneath the bridge. Pinch this between your thumb and your middle finger. Cross it over your index finger. Flex your index finger. Catch it on the back side. Pull it through and pull this one out. And then again, yeah, cross your hands on your second throw. And that will give you a one-handed knot to form square knots. Again, your pattern, want, you want it to look like that.